Hello Redlands. Australia has come a long way over the past year and we can all be proud of the role that each of us have played. But the pandemic is far from over and there's many Australians doing it really tough and it's important to note just how well the government's plan is working. And this year's budget, it's about securing our recovery and building our future. And it includes further tax relief, so important for around 63,700 taxpayers in Redlands. And it rewards hard work and it stimulates local spending. Continuing the instant asset write-off helps businesses invest, about 16,000 of them right here in Redland City. We've got about 1,265 apprentices in Bowman. They are so important, as is the extension of the Job Trainer Fund, leading to more opportunities for young Australians. And of course, committing $2 billion into Queensland for projects that are going to ease congestion, connect our suburbs and communities, and obviously improve road safety and getting home on time. The Morrison government is continu continuing to guarantee essential services. We all rely on them and they rely on a strong economy. That's why we're extending telehealth consultations right through to the end of the year. And already about 330,000 of them have been delivered since we made that change right here in Redlands back at the start of the pandemic, back in April last year. Childcare reforms we all care about, directly benefiting around 1,500 families living in Redlands. And it really does make the system for parents more sustainable and affordable. And then the signature policy of mine, the deposit assistance scheme, it's about getting people over the hump of needing a large deposit and into home ownership and not living at the whim of a landlord with an extra 10,000 this budget offered to single parents in that precarious situation where they're desperate to own their own home. Look, jobs are coming back, the economy's coming back, and Australia is on the road to recovery, and this budget is our plan to ensure that we come back even stronger. Authorised by Andrew Lamming, LNP, Cleveland.